The next step in the battle over North Carolina coal ash is here. Communities across the area are getting their first look at Duke Energy's plans to clean up. The company has submitted its intended moves to excavate millions of tons of coal ash. Our own Vanessa Rufus was in Rowan County where the community still had many concerns. Buckstein Station is one of 10 remaining coal ash basins that Duke agreed to close down. Since they made that announcement last month, the Department of Environmental Quality has been hosting public hearings to tell citizens how this closure would work and to hear their concerns. We just want them to be a responsible company like we are requested to be responsible citizens. It's a call we've seen before, most recently from environmental activist Aaron Brockovich, who responded to WCNC Charlotte's investigation into cancer clusters in Huntersville and Mooresville near Duke's unlined coal ash basin at Marshall Steam Station. Duke has denied any link. We cannot keep thinking that over decades there's been backdoor dumping, building on coal ash, putting that all out into the environment and possibly not think down the road, wow, that's a lot of cancers. Maybe that's not right. The DEQ says at some basins, crews will remove coal ash into lined on-site landfills. At others, like Buck, the ash will be recycled into cement, being burned first to remove remaining carbon. So they're monitoring, and, and of course the department has multiple inspectors from all those that'll, that'll be on site, and, and uh, you know the community's watching too, and I, I think uh, they understand that. Altogether, 80 million tons of ash to be excavated over 10 years or more at the price of 8 to $9 billion. Duke Energy's been right down at the end of my street. They have not paid the trash man to come pick up their trash for 33 years. Now they want me to also pay for that. That's just another slap in our face. There are three remaining public hearings to discuss the closure plans for Cliffside, Marshall, and Allen Steam Stations. You can find that information on our website, WCNC.com. In Rowan County, Vanessa Rufus, WCNC Charlotte.